I'm in Japan right now, and I'm going to show you some simple ways you can work on improving your deep Asian squat while you're in Japan or wherever you are. Today, to help me, I have this cool structure here. It's like a banana peel. How cool is that? And then all this stuff around me. So I'm at a kid's playground, and it's going to be super simple. I'm going to show you how to improve that deep squat. Let's go. So first thing you need is just something to hold on to. So I've got this slide right here that I can just put my hands on. And then what I can do is hang on and use that as assistance to help me do my deep squat. Nothing fancy here. You're just gonna use assistance as you need it and only go as deep as you can go without feeling like you're gonna hurt yourself. So make sure it's under control. And if it's not this deep, it's okay. Just go, you know, a couple inches, hold that position and then back up. The important thing to remember is that working on your squat isn't about trying to hit maximum depth right away. You're trying to do things safely so you aren't pushing through pain and you're not making anything hurt, pop, snap, or crack because you're trying to get super deep. It's important to remember that you need to warm up a little bit. So start with a set of five to 10 at a shallower depth. And as you feel more comfortable, you can start to get a little bit lower. On your second set, your third set, you can just try to go a little bit deeper. And if you feel like, hey, I've got a lot more range of motion to go, then go ahead and take that range of motion. Also, remember that when you're coming back up, you should be using your leg strength. Don't just use your arms to pull you back up. You want to build strength in your legs so that they can handle the deep squat position. And finally, remember that getting better at the squat is just about repeated position practice. It's going to take time, so just remember to have some fun with it, all right? All right, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed these tips, and I hope you're able to get into your deep Asian squat as you practice in a playground in Tokyo, Japan, or wherever you are. Check out my videos and my course on the Deep Asian Squat. I'll link all of that in the description box. Like, share, and subscribe with the bell notification on. And as always, I hope you remember that pain sucks. Life shouldn't.